if a tracheostomy tube has been removed during the emergency management of a patient, then primary emergency oxygenation starts off with the most basic non-invasive methods. This includes standard oral airway manoeuvres or basic tracheostomy stoma ventilation. If this fails, however, more invasive methods may be required. Here, oral intubation is used to try and secure an airway. Remember, intubation may be difficult and may be the reason why the patient had a tracheostomy in the first place. If you use an uncut endotracheal tube, then the tip of the tube and the cuff can be advanced beyond the stoma. This will allow effective ventilation. Be careful though not to advance the tube too far, which could end up in an endobronchial intubation. Clinical signs and capnography will confirm correct placement.